Uh, I grew up in Tallahassee, Florida. As a small boy, made a pretty large collection of pickled fish, and I knew the identifications and all the scientific names. And one of the local professors there took me out one time on a Christmas bird count, and that sort of was what turned me towards ornithology. My mother put up with that, yeah. She had a lot of experiences too, like I was taking my mammalogy course at Florida State and we had to trap mammals and prepare so many specimens of, you know, ten at least 10 different families of mammals, something like that. And uh, she came home one day and looking in the refrigerator to, to make dinner and thought she was opening up a package of liver and it was a paper bag full of cotton rats. So <laughs> she got over it. <laughs> The first fossil birds that turned up in Hawaii were in sand dunes on the island of Molokai. So I got a geological map and said, well, where are some other good sand dunes? And well, it turns out there were some on Kauai. So I flew over to Kauai one day by myself and got a car and drove out to this one set of sand dunes and walked out there. And within 15 minutes, I found this completely new genus and species of flightless goose. There was this fantastic skull and bill just lying there in the sand and it was a real eureka moment.